make a better Exorcist ripoff. tells me I shouldn't, but, God, I'll take the whole bottle. Drunkard! Father Davy Cross. It's an honor to meet you, Father. I need you to go to the liquor store for me. I need a two-four of beer, a box of wine, and a bottle of whiskey. The large one. Are you sure you... Shouldn't sober up first, Father. Why? You're not drinking, Davy. I've been on the wagon for ten years. May God help you. Why don't you drink some water, you cocksucker motherfucking drunk? It is booze that gives me my power. <laughs> it is whiskey that commands you. It is vodka that commands you. It is beer that commands you. It burns! It burns! The response, Davy. I, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. None of this stuff is in the Bible. Your mother drinks Bud Light in hell. The power of Christ compels you! The, the power of Christ compels you! 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 You're drinking too much, Father! The power of Christ compels you! Why don't you drink, Davy? Just take one for the road. I'm on the wagon! Ah! 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 Father Davy Cross, you're under arrest for child abuse and killing this old man. Ugh. I need a drink. What's up? You know, just making a smoothie. We need to talk. Yeah, about what? Well, I noticed you haven't been drinking much lately. Well, you know, it's trying to stay in shape. Canada Day's coming up. I need you in drinking shape. Canada Day, that's right. I'm gonna need your help, man. I'll show you how it's done. Teach me. I can do it.
to protect? Yeah. Don't throw up. I'm okay. Hey, you uh, want to watch a Canadian horror movie for Canada Day? Where's the beer? I forgot to make a special batch for Canada Day, but I did get a couple of beers from the liquor store. Better be Canadian. Oh, it's Canadian. And we're back from our little break, and we're starting season three of Frightfully Forgotten. But to start things off, what are we drinking today, Justin? Well, we're drinking plain old life-giving nourishing water. Mm. If you want the recipe, click the link above. Today, we're going to be talking about one of our favorite parts. I can't do this. What? This. A vacation from ourselves? Well, when you said we were going to take a month off, I thought that's what you meant. No, I meant it's a busy time of year. It's Christmas, New Year's, there's a lot going on. Not, uh, this. Oh, I don't know, I don't really think it's all that bad. I can't even look at myself with a mirror. I look ridiculous. I'm getting rid of it right now. You've reached Frightfully Forgotten. Please leave your horror movie request after the beep. Hi, Frightfully Forgotten. I just ordered one of your t-shirts and it came and it was crawling with bed bugs. was that? What? That intro. That's the new intro. That? Yeah, you said you wanted to do a new intro just like that one. I was kidding. Kidding? Yeah. That took a lot of time to put together. Well, what can I tell you, man? It's garbage. <sighs> hey, you ready to watch this week's request by Jason Willis? Oh yeah, Mazoleum. What did you just say? Mazoleum. Uh, it's mausoleum. No, it's pronounced mausoleum. You're just fucking wrong. Hey man, don't say I'm wrong. You'll be sorry. Or what? You'll put me in a mausoleum? <laughs> say it! Say mausoleum! You're gonna spill all the beer! Zolium! It's mausoleum! Zolium! It's mausoleum! Zolium! Zolium! It's mausoleum! Yeah. Say mausoleum. Mausoleum. Ah. Say it. Say it. No. Mausoleum. No. Say it. No. Say it. Mausoleum. 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 No. Mausoleum. Ah. Sometimes 
the basement's perfect, but the movie is at its end. If you go grab a beer, something's missing the empty spot that should be a friend. There's beer in the fridge, you call your best friend. There's Oh man, I had a pretty wicked dream last night. Really? Yeah. I had this awful nightmare. Really? What was your dream? Well, it was pretty wicked. We were running around the city. We were kind of reenacting like this 80s, 90s sitcom kind of deal. Um, we were like heroes. It was, it was wicked. But that was my dream. Really? Okay, ready to watch another patron requested movie? Oh yeah, Almost Human by Umberto Lenzi. Sounds like it's a great Italian horror flick. Yeah. This isn't a horror movie. Uh, oh yeah. Man, I found some great costumes for today's episode. How big is that keg that you bought, by the way? Party sized. Say, do you think these pants are too tight? Good God. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Nosferatu, happy birthday to you. Okay, blow out the candles. Blow out the candles, blow out the damn candles. You're getting a little close there, man. You're getting a little, hey, hey, hey Nos, hey, hey, holy oh, no. shit, you're on fire. Oh, oh no. no, Nosferatu's on fire. Oh. Hey, guess what? I just got a movie request for a movie called Nightlife. Oh, Nightbreed, the Clive Barker movie. No, Nightlife. Night Shift? Isn't that a comedy? No, Nightlife. Are you hearing what I'm saying? I haven't seen 30 Days of Night since it first came out. What the hell are you talking about? What are you doing over there anyway? I'm uh, editing this week's episode. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll watch Life Force later, don't worry. Nightlife! Nightlife! <laughs> L-M-N-O-P. The plot of this movie reminds me a lot of uh, when you first bought your house and you thought it was haunted. Huh. Adam is coming over to see my new house. I am going to Justin's house to see his new house. I think my new house is haunted. Oh? See? In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, leave this house. Your table's at an angle. Oh, I did not notice. Everything's all right now. Come on, come on, I want to see what happens. Just because I had a nightmare about a church doesn't mean my hand's going to go through the mirror. Oh, I got a phone call from uh, Stephen Bay. He wants us to do spiders. Now back to the mirror. See? I told you, that hat thing only works in the movies. Damn. Oh. Oh, we got another Patreon request. Oh, from who? From Stanley Surik. Silent Madness, 1984. In 3D. Oh. Ah, Captain Kirk! Hello? Hey, what you up to? Nothing. Have you seen that new uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre movie that came out on Netflix? Oh, so it's a sequel to that 2017 Leatherface movie? No. Oh. So it's a sequel to Texas Chainsaw 3D? Uh-uh. So it's a sequel to the remake? Nah. It's a requel to the prequel of the remake. What the hell does that mean? I, I know. Direct sequel to Toby Hooper's classic 
Original sequel, Texas Chainsaw Massacre Part 2. I think it's a sequel to the original one. Another one of those? Something tells me we're going to need a lot of booze for this. Okay. I'll grab a keg and head on over. So, he says to me, my favorite horror series of all time is The Conjuring. <laughs> <laughs> so what'd you end up doing? I threw him off a bridge. <laughs> Yeah, actually throw him off a bridge. Oh, look, uh, we got a new patron request from John Adano for The Dentist, 1996. Did you actually throw him off a bridge? <sighs> oh, oh, hold on a second here. Ah, oh, looks like we got another Patreon request by uh, Mark Miller. Uh, for what? Uh, Uncle Sam. Uncle Sam? Yeah. Better just keep hitting me with this stick. Before we get started, is everyone present for the Frightfully Forgotten Season 6 production meeting? It's just me. You're supposed to answer present. <sighs> present. Everyone present. And uh, we have someone taking meeting minutes. I can take them. Justin taking minutes. You know, do we have to do this now? It's three o'clock in the morning. I gotta go to work in a few hours. Yes, yes. We have to choose an underrated part six horror movie to kick off season six. How about uh, Freddy's Dead? Ah, uh, that movie should be forgotten. Halloween six? Let's save that for October. Okay. Uh, well... Uh, I don't know. How about uh, Leprechaun Back to the Hood? Oh, God, no. Well, Children of the Corn, 666. The Return of Isaac? I can't think of any good Part 6 horror movies. Maybe we're going about this all wrong. It's Dead of Winter, it's January, it's Winnipeg. How about an underrated uh, Snowbound horror movie? Hmm, all right. Well, how about uh, the Shining miniseries? People have been asking us to do it. Shining miniseries, perfect. Man. I can't believe that we're on season six already. Yeah. And to think, at one point we were estranged for 15 years. The best friend of Justin Bush walks out of the past. He teaches his friend how to brew in the basement. But I want to drink. Yes, so did I when I was your age. And I am your age. Boil over destroyed that basement. Best friends each believed the other had perished. Fifteen years later, they were reunited. Adam was drunk. And Justin got sober. I'm not like Adam, okay? I'm not a drunk. I review movies on YouTube. That's who I am. That's what I do. I am Adam. I will not drink you.